to the meeting of the George River Local uh, Traffic Advisory Committee. I declare the meeting open at 10.05. The Council acknowledges the traditional custodians of the land on which this meeting has been held as that of the political people of the Aura Nation. Um, any apologies? Yes, uh, Mr. Brian Hankin, thank you for the Mr. Rico Emiliano, F1, same time. Uh, a late apology also from um, for Mr. Mark Curie. Uh, I advise staff and the public that the meeting is being recorded for minute taking purposes. The order of business is as shown in the agenda will be made available. Council's code of meeting practice prohibits the electronic recording of meetings without the express permission of council. Mobile phones must be turned to silent during the meeting. Uh, any disclosures of interest? No disclosures of interest. Thank you. Uh, I understand there's uh, one public participant. Yes, there's one public participation. Um, a letter that was sent to Council in regards to TAC 088-23, with the curb parking at the Crescent Kingsgrove. I'll read out the submission. I'm a resident of Tullawatta Street, Beverly Hills, and I have been raising concerns with Council about the illegal parked vehicles, heavy vehicles in the Crescent Kingsgrove and the associated noise problems since 2016. Council approved the installation of time restricted parking in sections of the Crescent in December 2022, which has been partially implemented. For various reasons, the signs have yet to be installed on the western side of the Crescent that mainly runs parallel to Tullawatta Street and alongside the Black Forest Reserve. While the signs that have been installed have been effective in reducing the number of trucks that are illegally parked and the associated noise, residents continue to be disturbed by trucks parking overnight along the Einstein section and in the parking bays. The enforcement action taken by Council has also helped in reducing the number of heavy vehicles parked illegally, although it has little effect on reducing the noise from heavy vehicles that arrive or depart overnight. These particular heavy vehicles tend to arrive and depart outside normal business hours, thus including the Council enforcement officers. When residents have contacted police to, for assistance with noisy refrigerated trucks, it is given very low priority, which results in the noise continuing until the trucks depart the area, as police have been unable to attend. The installation of the rear to curb parking signs and the positioning of sandstone blocks within the parking bays together with the installation of the outstanding time parking restrictions should result in a marked improvement on the current situation. I strongly urge members of the committee to support this proposal. Uh, thank you. Uh, I call for a motion to um, adopt the minutes of the previous meeting. Uh, moved by uh, Matt Chaplin, Sergeant Matt Chaplin. Um, I'll second that. And I'll now call for a, um, at this stage of the meeting, 10.08 a.m. I hereby advise that the meeting will be, sorry, uh, first need a um, mover and second that are going to close session. Moved by Matt and seconded by Sharp. At this stage of the meeting, being 10.08 a.m., I hereby advise that the meeting will move into a closed session to allow consideration of the matters of the agenda. Accordingly, members of the press and public are excluded from the closed session. I ask the uh, senior manager the senior um, asset engineer if any representation has been made um, from the public that items should not be discussed in closed session. No representations. Uh, there are no members in the gallery, and please note that the live stream will resume following the closed confidential. Okay, and um, welcome back to open session and to all the people online. Um, 
So I'll call for a motion to confirm the recommendation from the closed session. Yep, moved by the Pat and seconded by the Shah. Uh, with no more items on the agenda, anybody call the meeting closed at 11 a.m.? Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Thank you.